Hello, I'm Russ Safferstein, partner in charge of Anshin's Digital Risk Solutions Group, as well as president of Redpoint Cybersecurity, Anshin Cybersecurity Arm. I want to talk to you today about cybersecurity risk and how we can help protect your organization going forward. One thing we want to focus on is cybersecurity is a journey, and everyone's on a different level on a maturity scale relating to where they are on their journey. We want to focus on, would you even know if there was a hacker in your network, in your email, in your phone? Many times when I ask clients that, they don't really have the answers for that. We want to make sure you know what is going on within your network. First things first, we got to get rid of a few myths. Myth number one is we're not a risk, we're too small to be a target. Well, 60% of small businesses have been attacked by a cyber criminal. You're probably one of them, and you don't even know it. Myth number two, well, if they wanted to get in, they'll get in. There's nothing we can do to stop them. That's probably true. But we really believe the best way to protect your organization is not from a defensive point of view, but more from an offensive point of view. And myth number three, well, we have IT. It's their problem, not ours. Well, really, cybersecurity is everyone's responsibility, not just IT. We want to make sure that everyone knows what the right rules of engagement are relating to IT and relating to cybersecurity. Cybersecurity, like I said, is a journey, so we need to have a practical approach to assist us along as we mature. First, you need a baseline figuring out of what our activities are, and as you move up the maturity scale to have regular testing of security controls, and finally, when business as usual, when you're running tabletop exercises and attack simulations, etc. But really, first things first, we need to create a baseline for your organization. So what are those security must-haves? Two-factor authentication and strong password policies. You got to protect your credentials. Those are the easiest ways of doing that. Understanding your data backup pro policy. You want to make sure your date, your critical data is not just backed up, but it's easily accessible and you can test it and make sure you can bring it back up and running. You want to have a cloud first strategy, making sure that we're focusing in on having not an on-premise server or email, but really focusing that business into the clouds. Have an incident response plan and test it. Many times organizations they don't even know who to call. Make sure that that plan is up to date and that you have the right indicators of who to call when something bad occurs. Are we training our employees? Are we testing them for phishing, et cetera? Making sure they understand what they need to be doing. Is your cyber insurance policy up to date? Many times we've, we come across situations when their cyber policies are out of date and their extortion payments are much too low. Make sure that your cyber insurance is up to date and you're reviewing it regularly. And lastly, have a trusted security team like Redpoint to help out if something does actually occur. Those that are, are focused on security on a day in and day out basis can better help protect your organization going forward. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us at Redpoint and have a great day.